Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to Fallout 4 and to the Far Harbor DLC. My name's Camel and this video is going to be a guide in which I will show you how to find the set of T-51 power armor with the Vim refreshing paint job. What we will need to do is find this Vim cargo container found on the back of this truck trailer. Now this is located to the northwest of Far Harbor, but more specifically to the north of the National Park Visitors Center, all of which you can see on the map right now. If we look through the bars, we can see something's inside. Luckily for us, there's no locks, but when we do walk up the back of the truck and go to enter, we will actually find a skeleton holding a note. This is Carlo's note, and it reads, Carlo, look, I know you need the overtime, but you are literally walking around with a target painted on your back, man. We've lost three shipments the past month, and the last suit of power armor we sent out was stolen right off the truck. Whoever is doing this seems to be more interested in damaging Vim's equipment than hurting us. What I'm saying is if shit goes down, ditch the power armor and get the hell out of there. I don't care what those dicks in marketing say. Signed, Willis Rudd. Now when we walk up to it, we can see that the entire set is T-51 power armor. And when at the power armor station, we can see that it increases agility with all pieces painted. So it's really not anything too special, more of a collectible piece. And here it is, the Vim's refreshing power armor painting paint job in all of its green, envious glory. Of course, as we can see, it's a lime green color. There is a faint white lime on the chest and you've got Vim. Refresh is written right across the middle of the breasts. A little bit further down, it's good to see that they clearly marked the star of the show. On the pauldrons, we have exactly the same decal that is found on the front of the chest piece. On the shins is written, Escape to Adventure. So that's always good. And that's pretty much it. And you might be thinking that this armor looks a little bit over the top, but you know, sometimes it's good to stand in the limelight, or in this case, standing inside the limelight. And we're quite lucky that visually we didn't get lemons. We got lime. And although we're probably all going to catch AIDS from this, it has to be said. This new custom Vim paint job is incredibly refreshing. So there you have it, the Vim refreshing power armor paint job. I hope you find this with ease and you can add it to your grand collection. And there we have it, ladies and gentlemen, there is my guide to the Vim refreshing power armor that can be found in Fallout 4's DLC Far Harbor. If you did find this video helpful, please feel free to click on the playlist button on screen. This, of course, will take you directly to my Fallout 4 guides playlist where you can select the videos you wish to watch freely. Or you can check in the description where it will be frequently updated with links to new Fallout 4 guides. Oh, and also be sure to follow me on Twitter. As always, thank you very much for watching and I will see you very shortly in the next video. I'll see you there in a second.